While it's really popular to say something is dying when it's really just a clickbait title, Fortnite is not going down. While 2020 has been a very weird year, maybe an asteroid will slam into the epic servers, for now, that's not what's happening. So there's this website known as Google Trends that shows a relative search data. Basically, the high point of 100 means the most search that something got. So here you can see Fortnite's 100 and Fortnite's 20, 50, that kind of thing. So you can see that Fortnite has been relatively stable over the past year. Well, how could we compare this to something else that will help give us a good indicator about how well it's been doing really? How about we compare it to the popular Taylor Swift? So the amount of search that Taylor Swift picks up is gonna be less than the amount of search that Fortnite picks up. And that is shown in this Google Trends graph because it's about relation to each other. So relatively, Taylor Swift is a smaller person on Google searches than the all the Fortnite. This isn't crazy, Fortnite's huge. All right, so I just added a third thing in here, Call of Duty. This is a very successful game series. It's been successful for a long time. And you can see again on the graph in that yellow line that's Call of Duty, that it is at times bigger than Taylor Swift, but not always, but still comparatively to Fortnite, it's significantly smaller, maybe about a third of the total search traffic on Google search. Now there's another piece to note here. You can see now that the graph looks a little bit different. Well, that's because I switched it over to YouTube search, which is the second largest search engine in the entire world. So when you're looking on Google, Fortnite is bigger. But when you look on YouTube, Fortnite has this huge increase compared to both Call of Duty and Taylor Swift. So also, what if we extend the timeline? over the course of five years. You can see that there has been, in fact, drops in Fortnite's popularity on YouTube. You can see that the spikes of Taylor Swift in red, you can see the spikes of Call of Duty in yellow, and you see this massive spike in 2017 of the growing popularity of Fortnite Battle Royale. You also can see this downward trend graph on this part here. Well, you, that's a sad, that's a dying, that's a feeling less popular. But even at the lowest point here, we still see that Fortnite is significantly more popular than Taylor Swift, who is very famous, and then Call of Duty, which again, very big. So whenever you hear clickbait like something is dying, you can check. You can look at graphs like in Google Trends to see if there's been an actual drop in search. Right now, we see Fortnite has another resurgence in search, and even at its lowest point, it was significantly more searched than things that are very popular and successful. Thus. Dying, maybe you'd feel that way in a slowing of popularity, but it doesn't mean it's going away. Links down below if you're interested in looking at Google Trends yourself.